if you love the turtles at any point in your life then stop right now go spend 20 bucks supporting some cool indie dev tribute games and dot m you nailed the nostalgia factor you have two options when you start the game which is the story mode and the arcade mode in story mode the more casual mode and the mode i prefer to play in you have the option to select three levels of difficulty and you have an overworld map where you travel from episode to episode and if you die in the campaign mode you're just going to get to continue from your highest unlocked episode which is a lot more convenient the shortness of the game is both a double-edged sword because at the end of the campaign which only lasted a few hours it's a nice trip down memory lane but on the flip side it begins to feel a little repetitive in the back third and the replay factor will be in the eye of the beholder because you can finish the game in about two to three hours it also would have been nice to be able to run through the game with some turtle ai in solo mode that can be helpful but aren't overpowered shredder's revenge feels like the original saturday morning cartoon before you know it it's over if you're a fan of the genre tmnt or on game pass it's a great way to spend a few hours